This is the final warning. Checkmate officially in progress. There will be a high level of shilling you're going to see in this period. You will see more people saying that they are giving up or selling or AAF us and many, many other things on top of that. These people will try everything to get your shares. With cost to borrow tipping over 400%, they are choking. AMC and APE are becoming almost impossible to short. Now, if you're willing to pay a 400% borrow fee to short a stock, well, I guess that's on you. But the finish line is in sight, and it's going to be beautiful and epic. All of this is my opinion, of course, not financial advice, as always. This ape says, just to be very clear, the AMZ share price being $4 has nothing to do with fundamentals and debt. Profitability, reverse, no reverse, no diluting in the past. It has everything to do with predatory shorting and all the buying pressure being robbed from being sent from the lit exchange to off exchange dark pools. And this is out of Gary Gensler's mouth himself when he said that 95% of retail orders don't go through the lit exchange. And Gary Gensler announced this a long time ago on Bloomberg. And yet every single day, look for yourself. Look at the off exchange trading for AMC versus the on exchange. The numbers are staggering. AMC was $72 before the illegal buy button removal. If you guys remember, I was there. I remember. The buy button is still removed thanks to the off exchange and dark pools, robbing all the buying pressure, and that's what's making AMC share price so low. AMC is down around 95%. Why won't any call out this off exchange dark pool fraud that's going on? Why is this being left in the dark? Who remembers when the SEC turned off dark pools for two or three days in 2021? Every single short stock was making huge gains. Don't tell me dark pools are not affecting the stock price because yes, they actually are. The SEC is complicit. Dark pool abuse. This is how Gary Gensler's market works. I default on my house or car. I lose them and can't get new loans. Hedge funds default on fails to deliver. Lose nothing. Regulators don't make them cover and they get million more. Rules written for the rich. Gary assists them only the progress. Only progress is 1%. I'm looking forward to hearing what Adam Marin and the team hear, if anything, from FINRA and the NYSE on why AMC's fails to deliver are averaging in the millions upon millions per day as of February 2023.